Good morning all. The world and its laws are turned upside down. Right, I'm going to give you a quick for instance, right? I'm going to make this video very short because i got to jump out and start to do a bit of walk here. <coughs> but, um, in the United States of America, right, animals have more rights than human beings now. Now, I'm going to tell you why. Now, there's a law against this symbol of America, which would be the American Eagle, or the, the Eagle, right? The bald eagle, not the American Eagle, but the bald eagle, right? If you kill a bald eagle, it's like $250,000 fine and a maximum of up to 10 years, maybe, or five years in prison. It's one or the other. But yet, you can abort a nine-month-old baby that's after being born out of the mother's womb, or even in the w mother's womb, they say it's not even a human, they say it's just a clump of cells. These are the fancy words they use, these people. A clump of cells. Right? Now listen to this. In the book of Genesis, God was very, very clear, and he's very clear to his whole word. God's word is real. It's the only real thing you find on this, on this earth. In the book of Genesis, God said... I give man dominion over the fish in the ocean, the cattle on the earth, all crawling and living things, and all the fowls, the birds of the air. We have dominion. But yet now, the rulers of this world are giving the animals dominion over us. Right? Can't you see how everything's being torn upside down? Right? Just like the scripture said they would. God's word is 100% accurate. 100% accurate. You know? When God... When God... Um, when a woman gets impregnated by her husband... Right? It says in God's word, I knit you together in your mother's womb. The minute that egg is fertilized, human life has begun. Creation from God. And the enemy, Satan, is a perverter of God. He perverts everything that God has made good, bad. He wants to destroy human life. He wants man to marry man, woman to marry woman, which can't procreate to fill the earth. It's an abomination in the eyes of God. Everything is torn upside down. I thought I'd just make that short, quick and to the point message. Jesus Christ loves you all. I love you all in Jesus Christ. Be filled with the power of the Holy Spirit. Be filled with the Spirit of God. You know? We are living in the end of days, there's no doubt about that. You look around, the world is in chaos. But we are filled with the Holy Spirit of God. We are the light of the world. We are the salt of the earth. We have overcome the darkness through Jesus Christ. He who is us, he who is in us is greater than he who is in the world. God bless you all. I plead the precious blood of Jesus Christ upon you all. Be filled with the Holy Spirit. God bless you. I love you as all.